guys, welcome back to the show. Starting off today, we have a recall report. Yes. So guys, recall from Hyundai. Hyundai, 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 Hyundai. Hyundai whatever. That uh, Korean uh, car manufacturer uh, warns vehicle, or sorry. How did you not know this? I didn't know it was Korean. It's Korean. It's Korean. Oh, cool. Hyundai is Korean. Nice. Anyway, uh, moving on. Uh, so Hyundai uh, warns owners to- Wait, north or south? <laughs> so uh, Hyundai uh, warns owners to park outside and recalls 180,000 SUVs. Hold on, wait, wait, I have a question. Are they warning them against parking outside or warning they them They want you to park outside. Oh, they want they you to park They don't want you to park outside. in garages. Okay, tell me, Joe. All right, Why so, are they telling you to jeopardize your paint job? Yes. <laughs> Glad you asked, Peter. Well, so um, for the second time this month, Hyundai is telling some SUV owners to park outdoors because an electrical sort short in their computer could just spontaneously combust and light your car on fire. Which is why you don't buy a Hyundai. Okay. And if you live in California right now, if you park outside, your car will start on fire. So it's a catch-22. Yes, that's so true. Re realistically, if you're, it's, <sighs> it just, just buy something else. Don't buy a Hyundai SUV. Buy a SUV. Japanese car or an American is, car? This is SUVs, or German by car. the way. I forget which SUV they make. They make like it's a QR84, I think. Whatever. Nobody knows because whatever nobody it buys is, Hondas. Um, well, whoever buys Hondas, they buy, they buy the small little ones that cost like nothing. Right. That's exactly. what you buy a Hyundai for. Right. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um... So anyway, if you're buying a Hyundai SUV, rethink options because your car is going to light on fire. Next little bit of information for you guys. Oh, yeah. So uh, I was uh, surfing Instagram like many of us do. Mm. I, and uh, I came across this picture. Ooh. So it is a new uh, you know, 2021 Bronco yes. photoshopped to look like the one above. Like it's a 1978 Bronco. That's cool. actually really cool. I like it. Um, you know, basically the same thing, but with like square headlights. I think it looks a little bit better. Uh, I kind of I disagree. I think I think it looks equally look, as good. I mean, it's good. Personally, I didn't like the, I didn't dislike the old one so much. Mm -hmm. It's just you know actually the problem I have with the Bronco is the fact that the mirrors are kind of like too not forward. in the right place, too forward up on the cowl. Mm. Um, that that to me is more weird than everything else about it. Yes, we but, should be very careful right now because we might go on a tangent about Broncos if we're not careful. No. So. But anyway, so I was surfing Instagram. I thought you guys might like to take a look at what some people That's do nice. with Photoshop in their spare time. Guys, let us know. Do you prefer the Photoshopped Bronco or the real one? Yeah. Anyway. All right, and today, moving on, we have poll results. So you might remember last week, we each picked a car. We went onto the dealer's website, and with a budget of $40,000, we customized that car. Yes, we did. And we put it up there for you to vote on our Instagram. And the results are, Peter? Yes, I, I actually know the results. Are you guys ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, so on the Instagram. Wait, wait, wait. wait. So what's, what, what happens? What, who, oh, who, right. Who? And the loser oh, yeah, this is will important. be spinning the patent pending Wheel of Pain. Yes, it's taken a while to get. Yeah, it's yeah. taken it's, forever. It's, <laughs> you know, everybody shut down, so it's taken a long time. Anyway, so I have the results, guys. Are you ready? Yes, yes. I'm ready. So, do you want to take a gander at who actually won? Who, yes. Not the loser, not the guy who's going to be spinning the wheel, but the guy who got the most votes for yes. the best I'm, car. I'm, I'm curious. I think the Mustang. I think the Mustang won. Okay, well, you, you know how much? No, I just think it's a genuinely beautiful car. Yeah, anybody else? Did. Anybody else have any predictions? Do you guys think you, you won? Know, I think, Joe, did I you know, win? You know what? Actually, I think it would, would have been the Miata. You think the Miata no, won? Yes, I really? think the Miata, yes. We are, uh, okay, well, he, you're, you're well, all wrong. No, no, no. I won. I oh, was really? just no. putting that out there. Uh, <laughs> I, I guess I didn't realize how many people don't like good taste. No, no, no. Don't no, have see, good taste in cars. <laughs> Leo, Leo, that's not yeah. it. There's just a lot of people who like the Dodge it's Challenger. It's a 5.7 with the manual. That's a beautiful combination right yeah, I, there. Uh, okay, fine. We're not going to go Anyway, do you want to know who came, came in second? Uh, I do want to know who came in second. It was the Mustang. Yes. Uh, At least I placed pretty good. It was... Not super close, but it was pretty close. Now, there was a huge drop-off after that. <laughs> this is where things got very interesting. You see, Joe, yes. the Ranger mm -hmm. and the Miata, for a long time, were tied. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. Snap. You both had two votes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and then, something miraculous happened. You see, Joe... It just so happened that your sister happened along the pole. Oh, okay. So she was scrolling through there, 
And uh, do you want to take a guess at what she voted for? Oh, not, of course. Yes, yeah. she did. Yeah. So you <laughs> lost. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's time to bring out the Wheel of Pain. Yes. Oh, no. All right, Joe, you ready? No, but yes. Okay, there's the wheel. Uh, grip and rep, baby. Oh, that was a good spin. Don't, don't touch it. No, we're not touching anything. Last time you, you stopped it early. It landed on this one right okay, here. Okay. okay. Oh. And you got... Five dollars. Damn, in the wheel that, jar. That's a really crappy. One. Okay, so uh, Joe, do you got five bucks? On you know what? I do have five bucks. Or you could exchange I... it for the bomb. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna put five bucks. Uh... Oh, you know what? Unfortunately, best I can do is ten. Oh, yeah. Do that. <laughs> I don't have change. Oh, it's a shame. You lied. You're, they're real lied. It only said five dollars. Well, you can always uh, take the bomb. Well, how about I just rip it? How about I just? How about I just rip this in half? No, no, no. You, you, no, 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 I'm good. I'll put five dollars in the boiler jar. Okay. Yes. You could put a tenner. Yes. In the in the jar to fund a better wheel because this one's. <laughs> yes. It's a little homemade. It's a yes. So the the prototype here needs to be upgraded. So yes. You could put ten dollars in the in the jar to fund a brand new spanking wheel. Or, yes. Or you could spin it again. You could spin it again. You know what? I'll fund the wheel. I'll fund the wheel. Oh, what a I'll coward! Fund. No, 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 no. That's the that's the punishment we want. Hey, right. you know what? You would hate it just as much too. Putting it in the what? Putting five bucks in? Well, putting ten because I don't have a five on me. Oh yeah. Already. That was horrible content. Well, I'm really bummed out. I hey, was excited you know for today. Hey, you know what? I'm just happy that Leo didn't get what he wanted. All we gotta do is. Get you know, like I would also like to point out that Leo lost. I did lose mm. because first place is not winning, or second place is not winning. So <laughs> that, that is true. Is yes. that first place loser then? Yes, first place loser. No, I think Joe's first place loser. Oh yeah, no, it still goes opposite. So you're dead last yeah. no matter what. You know what? <laughs> the wheel could have been a little bit more exciting, but you know, sometimes they're more exciting than others. Yeah, and this time it was not exciting at all. Joe deserved to get some kind of pain inflicted on him. <laughs> that was pain, it hurt my wallet. <laughs>